Can you please try to pulse a couple times into the yellow? I want to see how well you can maybe control this and influence the uh, EMF around us. Come on. We know you can do it. You've been showing off for us all night. Can you do it again? How about hitting the highest color you can? Can you try to hit orange or the red? And one for yes, two for no. It's saying no. Are you out of energy? One. So it's basically we're tired. Oh, okay. we got to an orange. So you gave it a try, huh? And we're hearing activity just as that happens. How about a red? And I'll shut up. I know I'm very, being very kind of curmudgeon tonight. Did you hear that? I heard a knock above us. I know. That's a clear ceiling. I don't know if something could have fallen on there. Well, it could be expansion of the building with the heat. Can you hit one red? I know I probably annoy you, so I'll step out into the other room and do some other stuff. Can you hit the red? I just want to see you hit the red, even just once. Can you make your best attempt at getting all the way over to the right there, into the red? I promise I'll leave you alone. If you hit red, I'm going to walk out of this room. Well, <laughs> It's trying. Well, thank you. Thank you for trying there. I think we'll, I think we'll call it there because we're really pushing pushing it with you. But thank you. Can you give us your name on our recorders here? We have a couple of recorders running. Is this yours here, this one? Oh, boy. You know what? We'll play back the first set. Actually, I think that's... No, that one is yours, I think. Okay. That's the one she brought up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, mine's by the, um, the bar downstairs. Okay, good. Then so we got them all. Okay. Well, um, did you live here in the 1800s by any chance? One for yes, two for no. And just light up one single one. Uh, you don't have to go full tilt. How about the uh, 1900s? Early part of the 1900s. One, two. Okay, so not the 19, early 1900s. How about the 1940s, 50s? 60s and 70s? How about the 1800s? 1890? 1880? 1880s. So you're from about the 1880s. Did you work in the store? going on out there. It's talking like crazy. Should we bring it into the same room with us so we can monitor it better? Let's, would you like to come out with us so we can do some more of this in the next room? The only thing is that it pulses in there. This is one of the quietest rooms for the K2. We'll get all sorts of readings out there that are going to throw us off. It's, okay, so this room is it. So I could bring in the ovulus in here. Why don't we do that? Stuffy, huh? Yeah, but it's ideal investigation. <laughs> I really appreciate you doing this uh, and giving us something to work with. It's really nice of you. Um, we don't normally invade somebody's space like this, and, uh, and I'm sorry if it, it did disturb you. Uh, but on the other hand, isn't it cool that we came here to talk to you? I think that's kind of neat, huh? Hey, we just got another hit. I asked it if it liked us here, and it went crazy. And every time we've been saying stuff and getting responses here, we're hearing the ovulus go off. Yeah, it's it's uh, no, kind it's of weird because I think it said therapist would. My wife is a therapist, and unfortunately, that's oh my god. John, and it says said therapist twice. This, this, is, this gets set off by EMF. So yeah, I'm gonna it. turn that down. So let's just turn that off. I'm surprised you gave it. I'm not. This building has got a real history to it, so. 
But it was built. Was this building no, here before? It was probably the back alley. Maybe this is where everyone got invited. Hmm. No. So what have you been doing? <laughs> We're filming. Trying. To, we've been getting responses to questions on the K two. So we're asking questions to see what we get. Um, One thing that's interesting is... Um, Let's see if it recognizes me. That's what I was going to say, yeah. Um, um, go ahead and ask it. I don't know. You recognize Tony here, right? Tony's in this building all the time. He says he feels really at ease in this building, and it's a very comforting feeling, and he loves the building. One for, yeah, one for yes, two for no. So you just got a one. They know you. Hmm. Do you like me? One for yes, two for now. Do you like Tony? And this is the time we'll get even oh, used to. You yeah. don't? <laughs> That's disappointing. No, come on. You like Tony. You're just playing with him, aren't you? Because I get a feeling Gary, like you're a trickster. Are you just playing around with us? Weird. Is that what you said? Weird. Reverend? Having trouble hearing you. What did he say? We had a we had a pulse there. Yeah. The yes. So you do like me. There you go. Thank you. <coughs> Are you hearing a woman talking out there? You're gonna hear a lot of yeah. yeah, you're gonna okay. speak nice from here especially. Alright, so we just make So it are you a woman? Was that yes? No, it was definitely no. Uh, factory. Factory? Factory. See, I'm hearing this one. I don't understand what it says. So you're a man? Well, we had 15 different Coffee. spirits. Call. Do you want me to find someone else to operate this restaurant? And bring people back in the building? Tony's working really hard to make sure this building retains all its glory and history and the people appreciate it and love it. Is that important to you? Reminds me so much of what we get with your place. What's that? Like Nick. Like Nick. Who's Nick? It keeps talking about Nick. Hmm. Or I'm was, Nick. Was Nick, was Nick someone you... Placate. Placate? Burn Peril. Burn Peril. Did any of this building burn? At any time? Do we have a fire in nearby? I don't know about it, but about in 150 years, I'd say it might have burnt once or twice. <clears throat> Did this building ever burn? Was there a fire here? One. Were you in it? You said therapist twice tonight, one downstairs and one Said it two other times. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, it might be my wife, but I don't know. Can you say one of our names? Apple. Is apple? Did they grow apples out here or something? Oh, yeah. Apples were huge. This was one of the, a lot of people don't know this area, was the source of fruit for the sure. nation. Wow. Yeah. Oh my God! With the trains, they grew the fruit here. Loomis was huge for fruit. Yeah. <clears throat> Information. What do you say? Information. Sutter. Um, Supper. Sutter. Or Sutter. John Sutter was into a lot of stuff in this area. Jerk. Sutter. Jerk. Sutter was a jerk. 
That's not the first time I've had Sutter cult names on EVP. Was Sutter a bossy guy? Was John Sutter an idiot? Anguish and grief? Is that what he just he said? caused anguish and grief. Yeah, that's what he said. Hmm. So John Sutter created a lot of problems. More than he, more than he helped, he caused trou troubles. What are you getting there, Spence? Huh? What's your impression so far? Are we, are we chasing up a... I'm going to go ahead and stop because I think this is winding down here. <laughs>